Right now, more black faces grace gallery walls and adorn display pedestals at the Los Angeles County Museum of Art than at any time in the museum's 56-year history. The stars are Barack and Michelle Obama, whose portraits were commissioned by the National Portrait Gallery in Washington, D.C., and unveiled to a warm critical reception in February 2018. Now embarked on a national tour to five cities, the paintings, respectively by Kahinde Wiley, 44, and Amy Sherald, 48, open to the public in L. A. on Sunday. They occupy one wall of a large room, the empty space an indicator of an expectation for sizable crowds of eager viewers. Two-thirds are museum acquisitions and promised gifts, many recent, with the rest on loan from galleries and private collections. They're hung salon style, which yields a lively sense of visual conversation among disparate artists. The Obama paintings, each figure shown seated and depicted roughly life-size, are stylistically different from each other, although both italicize aspects of the sitter's personality. Within a light blue field, Cheryl depicts the former first lady as a paragon of focused elegance. Her skin is gray, as in a black and white photograph, the artist's frequent strategy for asking viewers of a painting to look beyond superficial assumptions about race. Dressed in a long but unstuffy wide evening gown, the geometric decorations on its billowing skirt a nod to designs in modern art, African-American quilts and current fashion, she rests her right elbow on her other forearm draped over a crossed knee. Michelle Obama's right hand languidly grazes beneath her chin, dangling blue fingernails that add a distinctive note of contemporary color. The pose is at once self-protective, her body shielded, and exquisitely self-contained, 